Hello everyone. Welcome to the 30th exercise of Autodex Fusion 360 beginner tutorial. In this exercise, I'm going to show you exactly how to design this figure using Autodesk Fusion 360. If you are new to this channel, do subscribe to us and turn on the bell notification so that you won't miss any of our new videos. Here are the dimensions of the figure and the tools and commands I'm going to use in this tutorial. Now, without wasting time, let's get into it. First, create a new design by going to File, Select New Design. The unit I am going to use in this tutorial is millimeter. Create a new sketch on the front plane. Go to Center Dia Circle. Select the center as the origin and give it a dia of 50 mm. Followed by a concentric circle of diameter 80 mm. Now go to two point rectangle. Select the first point of the rectangle horizontally aligned with the origin anywhere here and give it a dimension of 30 by 15 millimeter. Okay. Now press D to go to sketch dimension command or you can go to the same command from here. Select this corner of the rectangle and the origin. Provide a horizontal distance between them as 7.5 mm. Done. Hide the dimensions. I'm going to trim out these unnecessary portions from the sketch. So, under modify, go to trim command or you can press T for shortcut. Trim out these lines and this curve. Here is our sketch ready. Finish sketch. Go to extrude command. You can press E for directly go to extrude command. Select this outer profile. Drag this arrow up to a total distance of 40 millimeter. Start profile plane. Direction change it to symmetric so that we can have a total distance of 80 millimeter, 40 millimeter on each side. Click OK. Now create a new sketch on this right plane that is right plane. Under create, go to project. Selection filter specify identities. Select all these lines and curves and click OK. So that all of them will be projected on our current sketch and we can draw with reference to them. Press P to go to project again. Select this circle. Select this portion too. Now go to center circle 
and draw two concentric circles here. Give them dimensions of 30 millimeter and 50 millimeter. Press enter. Go to sketch dimension command. Select the origin and the center and provide a vertical distance of 125 millimeter in between them. Again select the center and this line and provide a horizontal distance of 40 millimeter in between them. Now go to straight line command. Select the first point on this point. Draw a vertical line of length 25 millimeter. Go to three point arc. Select the first point here, the end point on this circle and the middle point here. I am going to provide the radius later. Repeat the same steps here. Select the first point on this one, the end point on this circle and the third point or the middle point here. Press escape. Now under constraints go to tangent. Select this arc and the circle so they are tangent to each other. Again select this arc and this straight line. They are tangent to each other. Repeat the same step here, arc and the circle. I won't make this corner tangent. Instead, I will fillet the corner. So under modify, go to fillet, select this corner and provide a radius of 50 millimeter. Press enter. As you can see, this profile is open. We need to close it. If we hide the bodies, you can see this profile is open. So draw a straight line from this point to this point our sketch is ready finish sketch go to extrude again select this profile extrude it up to 25 millimeter change the direction to symmetric so that we will have a total length of 50 millimeter click ok turn on the visibility of previous sketch by going here go to extrude again select this profile extrude it up to 5 millimeter direction symmetric operation join click ok hide sketch to we need to provide some fillets on these two edges so under modify 
go to fillet select these two edges and provide a fillet radius of 50 mm press enter now select the whole body go to fillet and provide a fillet radius of 2 mm click ok here is our figure ready thank you guys for watching this video i hope you guys have learned something new in this tutorial see you in the next one till then keep designing and design whatever you love bye bye